Good morning guys, welcome to this video, starting the video off at Starbucks after Cycle Bar, what is new with my life. I've gotten a couple requests, one in-person request <laughs> to film this video, and I'm like, you know what, why not? And um, when I was doing my Instagram poll, I think, um, someone else asked as well, like, can you do a what I eat in a day video? And I'm like, you know what? Even though it's going to be boring and it's not going to be very entertaining. And then people are going to be like, oh, you're not eating enough. You're not eating the right things. You should become vegan. Like all of the above. I'm going to probably get those comments. But it's okay, you know, because this is realistic. What I eat in a day. Like I don't eat acai bowls or like avocado toast every day like that's just not it for me number one it's expensive number two it's just not me and if you haven't seen this one video I've done or I did I should say um I did a video of all the foods like I actually eat because I'm a very picky eater when it comes to food like I like routine just like in my day-to-day -day life so I typically just eat the same things. I know that I should probably eat better, but I don't think I eat that bad, to be honest. But I know that everyone has their opinions and stuff, and of course you can share it in the comments. Like if you think I should be a vegan or vegetarian, a-okay, but um, all I know is that carbs don't do well if you're like trying to lose weight. Um, which I'm not like necessarily trying to lose weight. I just, you know, carbs make you loaded and stuff. But yeah, just take this video with a grain of salt and just enjoy it for what it is if you want to keep watching. Thank you guys so much for being here and starting off, of course, we got the Starbucks drink. I do not eat until basically around one o'clock um, or noon. Noon is, noon is a little early, but I try to just stick to I guess I drink my breakfast and my order for this is a grande iced coffee light ice because they put too much ice sometimes and like the entire like four dollars I spend at Starbucks is like ice and I don't want that then I have two pumps of vanilla no classic syrup and almond milk and I swear I'm they probably hate me at this location because they always do my order wrong. Well, not wrong, but like, I'm like, can I please get a little bit more almond milk? Because yesterday it was just too much coffee, coffee. And when it's just too much coffee, coffee, it just doesn't taste good. It's like a little too bitter. That's why like I stopped getting the vanilla sweet cream cold brew number one, because I don't want to consume like that much dairy. So I'd always put a light, like a light splash of sweet cream but now since I've changed it to almond milk like it doesn't matter how much they put in really because almond milk tastes good and everything like that so I'm kind of going off on a tangent but this one just doesn't get it like I don't know if there's just new people I'm not trying to be rude but every other Starbucks that I go to this order they always get right so like the one close to my house the one in around Winter Garden area, and what other one do I go to? I go to the one in Celebration. Um, I haven't ordered this drink, but they always seem to get my drinks right when I go there. I don't know what's what's their deal, but it's okay. I'm not hating. I know that. I'm just saying it's a observation. <laughs> um, but they fi they always fix it, and they're always like super helpful and nice. But I'm I swear they hate me. Also, too, this is really weird but it's cheaper to come here to this location or the one in winter garden than it is by my house because the one by my house costs a lot more and i think it's because of like taxes like differing in taxes in different counties maybe i don't know but i find it to be really interesting so i have this in the mornings um it is around like 7 15 7 30 sometimes i come a little later um if i'm like talking to my friend after cycle bar and stuff i typically have this and then at one i have my lunch and i'll show you guys my lunch at lunchtime obviously 
so you guys can see that um, I pack it typically because it's just a lot cheaper and it's like again routine and like I won't be you know wondering like what am I gonna have for lunch today and then spending like $15 plus tip somewhere or something like that yeah and I've eaten the same lunch like you guys know what it is but I'm gonna show in this video for entertainment purposes like for forever so obviously I don't really mind having it but yeah um so far this is pretty much routine it's not too carb heavy and then my lunch is pretty balanced um dinner which i don't know what i'm gonna have for dinner tonight at all really so it's gonna be a gamble so that part will be exciting but i will say dinner is where like the heaviest stuff comes and like why I just like lose control and you know what and eat more triscuits than I should but this camera battery is flashing I'll put the other one in and I'm gonna just chill out drink my breakfast here guys I hate breakfast if you don't know anything about me like I hate breakfast I hate eating early it just weighs me down like I don't need any food this early in the day I'm gonna end it off here because I've just been chatting like so long so all right Okay, so sorry it's kind of loud out here, but uh, there's like tree trimming people here trimming back the trees in the parking lot. But first I have my vitamins. So I normally have my vitamin D. This is zinc. I don't know, I guess it's supposed to help with like breathing. I don't know. My mom was like, oh, it's good to take like during COVID. So I'm like, okay, whatever. And then I have my just regular Flintstone vitamin. Next, I just have hard boiled eggs, good source of protein. Then I have some saltine crackers, some shortbread and celery. Guys, don't hate on the celery. I love celery so much. Even in juice form, it's just so good. And water. I try to drink a lot of water throughout the day and stuff as well. Got out of work and now I'm stuck in traffic on the turnpike because I'm picking up dinner tonight. This is a good representation of like what happens. Either I pick up the food, which is rare, or uh, Sherry will pick up food or Valerie cooks. So as I mentioned before, dinner is like my heaviest meal, which is probably not the best, but it's fine. Um, I love dinner, I love lunch. And as you guys know, I do not like breakfast. Tonight we landed on Panera because uh, mother is uh, sick, she's a little under the weather, so she just wanted me to bring home some Panera, so I'll show you guys that. Um, we typically do like Four Rivers, Panda Express when they have stuff, which is like never, so we haven't eaten there in like months. Um, we do Hooters, Valerie cooks, so Valerie cooks chicken, she cooks salmon, um, and then we always have like a carb not when Valerie cooks, but we always have like a car when it comes to like dinner and Valerie doesn't cook and Hooters already like the breading, that's a carb. Tonight's dinner is gonna be a really good representation, like I said, because it's a pretty big meal. We get like the chips, I got the cookie because that's what I always get. So uh, yeah, I will show you guys once we get in. I swear, it's like rainy and cruddy out and traffic galore we made it to panera i don't know why i just saying that but anyway gonna go in now okay so guys this is how stupid i am <laughs> honestly uh it's kind of embarrassing but i think i paid for two six packs of the flip flop cookies and i really i was putting that i just wanted two flip flop cookies but i really do think it charged me for like 12 cookies. <laughs> so I'm over here like, oh ma'am, like I didn't get my cookies that I ordered. And she was all like, oh, well, um, I think you put 12. And I was like, no, I only want two. But I looked at the receipt and I was like, you know, it is kind of expensive because I spent like $48, but like our bill is normally pretty expensive so I just like gave Panera like more money so that's great hopefully I get some rewards on that yeah because I signed up for the rewards thing so I could do the mobile order but guys also always check the order because like shit be missing sometimes and like you pay for that or you know what you overpay for things and which is so annoying I should have been more careful but I was kind of just like in a hurry 
So it was my fault. It's okay. Um, I got the flip-flop cookies. I got two of them. And we are okay now. But still. So note to self, always check the mobile order and everything like that. Um, yeah, that was really dumb on my part. Okay guys, so this is my dinner. I have one out of the 12 flip-flop cookies. I can't believe I did that. Salad. Um, this one's kind of small. Sometimes they are kind of skimpy with the stuff, but it's fine. Mac and cheese and chips. And this is realistic. Like I do eat a lot <laughs> for dinner. Okay, so it is the next day and got us some Donatos because Sherry's still sick. You know what? I'm probably being honest in this video. Gonna eat the whole thing. I take off the cheese for most of them. Um, some of the smaller ones I leave the cheese on. But overall, this is the best pizza ever. And yeah, this is another thing what I eat in a day. It's just really good.